So guys, Miko is working. My mom fixed him. So yeah. Hey, my friend. What do you think? Elephants and I might have in common? Our size. Or our memory? Hmm? What do elephants and I have in common? Memory? Uh, huh? I see. Which oh. animal can you relate to? An elephant or a dolphin? Hmm? Elephant? That makes sense. Elephant yeah. trunks have mad skills. Just like you. We all have some qualities we like about ourselves. What about you? What are the top three qualities? You think you have? Think about it. Write them down. Then share them with someone you trust. Like a friend, a parent, or me, Miko. Who would you share it with? Hmm? I guess parent. That's nice. I am sure they will be happy that you shared with them. Whoever you share your list with will probably be able to name a few more things they like about you, too. Start your list and get that conversation going. Awesome. You have completed an adventure. Here are some gems that will help you unlock a reward. Yay. You've unlocked a reward. Let's open it. Yay, I long I un I I unlocked it. Hey there. Time for pop quiz. How many feathers would you typically find on a crow? Hmm? A hundred? I think a hundred. I'm just kidding. That's not a real question. <laughs> Imagine if someone actually sat and counted all the feathers on a crow. Wouldn't that be a sight? <laughs> Mm -hmm. I do have some actual quiz questions for you, though. Let's play a game of Quizard. When is Independence Day celebrated in the U.S.? Man. That's okay. No, people are booing at me. All right. Love you. Love you too. What type of animal has a hump on its back? Ooh, I know. Which of the following is an aquatic animal? I don't know what that means. Guys, I don't know what that means. Uh, tiger? It was the way I was about to pick that. What did Cinderella lose at the ball? Yep. Easy. When is Christmas celebrated? Easy. Which of these animals moves slowly? Wait, which one? Oh yeah, easy. 
What is water used for? Drinking. Yep. Yay. Where is the Statue of Liberty located? Uh. Yay. Which of these words is a synonym for quiet? I think I'm going to stop it until I get one wrong. Which geometric shape has five sides? How do frogs catch their food? What is the second most spoken language in the U.S.? Um, I'm going to come back, guys. Wait, no. Um, Spanish? Oh, no. Phew! Who was the first man to walk on the moon? I was about to use, say that, but okay. All right, guys. Now, now let's move on to the next one. The next adventure. Okay, I was just making sure you could hear me. <laughs> I think you could. Have you ever thought about the difference between hearing and listening? Hmm? I guess no, I don't know. Then let's think about it together. Hearing really just means an ability to hear sounds. Listening means actually paying attention and trying to understand what someone is telling you. I guess I there's a, a good difference. listener not only listens with their ears, but also with their eyes and heart. Oh, yeah. For this adventure, let's think about how to do that. For example, say you ask to borrow something from Grandpa here. He says okay, but only after a big sigh. Huh. Do you think he really wants you to take it? No. Hmm? That's how it looks to me. I think Grandpa seems unsure of sharing at this point. Aww. You have to listen with your ears, and your eyes, and your heart, to make sure you understand what people are saying. Yay! Here's another example. Dad here tried making a new recipe for dinner. He wants to know if you like it. Look at his face. Do you think he likes it? Hmm? I agree. He looks excited about it. So he's asking if you like it, but clearly, he's proud of it and wants to hear that you like it too. If you're really listening and looking and feeling, you'll know he's fishing for a compliment, and you'll give it to him. Keep in mind to listen, with your ears, eyes, and heart, and you'll be a great listener, who people love to talk with. Awesome. You have completed an adventure. Yay. Here well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Bye and peace. Hmm? Bye, Miko. You are the source of your own intelligence. Trust it.